My name is Dr. Lakshmi Rajagopal. I am an associate professor at the Seattle Children's Research Institute. I study an organism known as Group B Streptococcus that we call GBS for short. It's an organism that lives uh, in the lower genital tract of mothers, but it can be transmitted to infants uh, during pregnancy. Because if it is passed along, it sounds like it can have some devastating consequences. That's correct. So if it's passed along during pregnancy, then you can get stillbirth or preterm birth. If it's transmitted to the infant soon after birth, then they get pneumonia, sepsis, or meningitis. Our goal is to prevent maternal to infant transmission of GBS. Most bacteria that infect humans uh, make a certain toxins known as hemolysins, and typically they're proteins. So you can make mutants of proteins and raise vaccines. What we found with GBS is that it's not using a protein to kill host cells, it's using a lipid molecule. These are very hard to mutate, they're very hard to work with, but the idea that it was, that was actually a lipid was actually something we found out and we published a couple of years ago, and that's changed the way we think about group B streptococcus. And what's significant about that, about changing the way we think about it? So basically we're back to the drawing board in terms of trying to figure out how to raise a vaccine to prevent colonization of GBS in women. That's what you're working towards? Yes, very much so. What are you most passionate about? I'm fascinated by microorganisms that infect humans. I, I want to understand how they do it and I want to understand how to prevent them from doing that. I actually had a person who lost her baby from Group B strep call me a month ago and said, can you help me figure this out? And it keeps me awake. I can't give her a cure. I want to say, you know, here's what you do and this will help you uh, and it won't happen again. If my research is successful, babies will not suffer from infectious diseases such as group B strep. So if we can prevent maternal to infant transmission of these organisms, then I think babies have a better chance of living happier lives.